We begin tonight with the National Weather Service confirming three tornadoes touched down in our area yesterday. One tore through the city of Chesapeake, then it hit Virginia Beach. Another tornado touched down in Suffolk, and the third hit Birdie County in North Carolina. The storms left behind a trail of destruction. Our Jacqueline Lee went to Virginia Beach to talk to neighbors about how they're dealing with the aftermath. Nothing but devastation left behind after last night's tornado. Now I do want to show you one of the homes that are heavily damaged after last night. Take a look. The siding dangling off of the front wind gusts so powerful that the paneling got ripped off. Take a look at the fence over there. It's in pieces. It was ripped out of the ground. Now the National Weather Service did confirm it was an EF2 tornado, which means there are wind gusts of up to 120 miles an hour. Take a look at these tree branches. There's insulation damage dangling off of them like leaves and these tree branches are up and down the block. Now I do want to show you some of the damage left behind on the cars. Take a look at this. The windows are completely bust open. Now this is going to take a long time to rebuild. The good news is the community is coming together to try to pick up the pieces left behind. Just woke up and I heard my wife screaming. For Mike Mingo, last night was nothing short of terrifying. The windows and everything was being sucked out. He and his family trapped in their own house. The roof just started sucking. Uh, all the installation on the top was coming down. Luckily, they survived, but the same can't be said for the place they've called home since 1991. And, and you just can't believe it's happened. But now, some solace in the midst of a devastating situation. It's Leo. Thank you. Hey, you're welcome. It's something simple as getting a teddy bear out, getting a Peppa Pig doll. You know, it, it all makes the day worth it for me. And despite the destruction left behind, they are rebuilding together. In Virginia Beach, Jacqueline Lee, 13 News Now.